Hello, board members. How are we doing this fine, fine Sunday afternoon? Well, I hope. <clears throat> As it is Puzzle Sunday, and we did finish up a Real Mist Masterpiece Edition last week, um, we're going to be starting something new and very different with Freddy Fish and the Missing Kelp Seeds. That's right. It's we're, we're going throwback. We're doing something simple. We're getting back to basics. 1994 basics. But welcome, I swear I'm not an elk. How you doing? I don't know if I don't know if Vic is gonna be here. He didn't he didn't post anything over in the Discord about anything today, so maybe he's sick or maybe he's really busy. Who knows? Maybe he got roped into helping his brother do some more moving or something. It's hard to say. But how are you doing today? I swear I'm not an elk. Oh, there he is. We weren't sure about you there, Ika. Welcome. How goes it? Uh pretty good. Uh Sunday job wasn't too too bad. Um Got some uh, 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 Carl's Jr. on the way home, and now it's time to learn with the fish. <laughs> There's the bonk. Oh no! <sighs> you gotta. You, you can't bonk Ika. You have to bonk. Um, d uh, not Dumbledore. Uh, Hagrid. You gotta bonk the Hagrid. Two streams in a row now. <laughs> I know. It's almost like I maintain some kind of schedule. There you go. You gotta bonk the Hagrid. But as we were talking about, um, I, have a, I have enough bongs for both. Just, just, I, just, <laughs> I just picture you have a large backpack just full of baseball bats coming out of it. And you're just bonking people and throwing them away. Um, but it's good to hear you're doing well. Ika, how are you? Hopefully you had a, a nice day off. Single-use bonks? Yeah. You wouldn't sully yourself with using a, a bonker twice. You have the raw resources to be able to bonk, uh, get all the bonkers you need. It's like your special ability. <sighs> all right. So, um, as, as we were talking about, we were going back to 1994, into my youth. And we were going to be playing some Freddy Fish and the Case of the Missing Kelp Seeds. Uh, this is a learning module for children to help them uh, learn basic problem solving, and how to use a computer. So let's go back. Go back and see how much it can teach us. Because some people definitely need to go back to kindergarten and relearn the basics of, of being a person. You're doing good? That's good to hear. We didn't. I didn't see anything from the... Why would you need to play this in safe graphics mode? What does that mean? What does safe graphics mode mean? What? What does that mean? Also, we have a redemption of I uh, hats off to you. Okay. You're looking particularly professional today. Please allow me to ruin that. <laughs> All right. <laughs> uh, um, let's see. All right. This is a pretty relaxed stream, I would think. So let's go to the beach, shall we? Oh, let's go to the beach with a pretty relaxed stream. Uh the hair is neat. The posture is good. Needs a hat. Yeah. And what better hat to go to the beach and hang out with a fish than uh, than, than a, a, a classic beach hat, right? <sighs> okay, let us... <laughs> I'm, I'm so nervous to actually try to play this. I'm hoping it works, and hopefully we can hear it and stuff. Wow, that fish is actually very capable of jumping. Power, Sam. <laughs> sure thing, Freddy. They're wonderful. If you get stuck on this monster, we hold the right Sam. to ri ridicule Goodbye, you. Fair. Whoa. Well, I I take a mild. I I declare at least a little bit of. It might be so bad it's unintelligible. I do declare a little bit of that. Freddy Fish in the case of the missing kelp seeds. 1994. Wow, that was a quick little. Hi, Snappy Turtle. Hi, Freddy. <laughs> hey, Snappy, you look like you need some cheering up. For me? Well, I was about to say, Freddy. that turtle does not look like it's interested in Have Freddy's nonsense. Day. Bye. There was a lot of extra mouth movement on the end of that. Here's a flower for you. 
Thank you, Freddy. What's wrong, Grandma Grouper? Someone took my treasure chest. Grandma, oh no, she's been robbed. The chest that holds all the kelp seeds. Yes, Maja was pretty quiet. Okay, I'll turn garden. it down. It's dying. <laughs> oh no, I don't. Until we find my treasure chest, we have no food. Wait, what? I'll find your treasure chest, Grandma Grouper. Oh, thank you, Freddy. Here's my last peanut butter and jellyfish sandwich for your journey. Good luck, Freddy. Don't worry, Grandma Grouper. I'll find your kelp seeds. Are you are you getting a double of the of the audio right now? By the way, or is the audio sound okay? I'm getting some weird stuff on my end. I don't know what's going on, but. Welcome, Crusader Monkey, by the way. Um, turn this down a little bit, and I'm going to turn that up a little bit. <clears throat> I don't know. I, it... But welcome, Crusader Monkey. How are you doing this fine, fine day? And shh, that's okay. No, we have to make sure everyone can learn all we can. A God, aquatic Dark Souls. Yeah, 1994 is Aquatic Children's Dark Souls. Whoop. So we have a sandwich, apparently. It's a beautiful day under the sea. Okay, that's. Wow, it actually has four animations on that. What is going on? Is that, is that louder, by the way? Uh, this module is a year older than me. Just a year older than you. Really? Oh, see, yeah, I, I would have been... Oh, God, I would have been seven when this came out. Uh, I'm doing fine, and you? I'm doing okay. Had work, and now we're here to we're do something very casual, very relaxed. <laughs> it's louder, but I so wish it wasn't. Why? What's What's wrong? I mean, they even changed the color of the fish, which is nice. Oh, no, I guess it's the same color. I thought that first fish was blue. Oh, yeah, they just changed the color. Was that a ghost? Wait, why is there a guy inside of our grandmother's house? Why does Freddy have eyebrows? And where did she, where did she put the sandwich? I, these are questions. There's a ghost inside of grandma's house that doesn't want us spying on, on, on them. Luther, what are you doing? I'm trying to swim a loop to loop. Fish pockets, yeah. Ow! Hey, Freddy, bet you can't swim a loop to loop. It's easy. Wow! Let me try again. Ow! Look, Luther, Okay, so he's just an idiot. And there's a note inside. What's well, between the, the scales, right? It says... To find Grandma Grouper's treasure chest, go to the old whale bone. I'm gonna be rich when I find that treasure. So you're just... We need to find Grandma Grouper's treasure chest because that's where the kelp seeds are. If we don't find them soon, all the fish are going to die. I'll help wow. you find them, Freddy. We're on a mission. <laughs> kids, the kids like stonks, yeah. You're brave, Freddy. Hey, Freddy, you think we'll find Grandma Grouper's kelp seeds? Of course, Luther. We found the purple sea urchin. Oh, apparently that was a thing I needed. All right. Was that fish naked? That's... That's weird, right? Bit worried about Luther's lack of eyeballs. It's a little, I mean, they only show up sometimes. Hey, 
Wow, you can really just... There is a lot of stuff to interact with in these actual things. Alright. So we gotta go to the old whale bones, apparently. Also, I swear Freddy is calling the other fish loser. It's Luther. It's Luther. The bottle ain't here, boss. Maybe somebody else found the voice. <laughs> Maybe somebody else found it first. Of course someone else found it first, you spongehead. Come on, we gotta find that bottle. Oh, we're shark bait. But, boss, do we are sharks. That was a funny joke in 1994. For children. Okay, so is there actually anything going on here? Or is it just this, these fishes with glasses doing things? Okay, so I think we came from this way, right? Let's keep moving. Bonk? What? Animation's so good they had to clarify their species? Yeah. Just in case. Stockholm Syndrome? That's Stockholm Syndrome, right? Like, he's, he's, he's institutionalized and he doesn't know how to live outside of the system, so now he has to live in a, in a bowl no matter where he is. Oh, it's alive! Okay, well, that's a different problem. Also, we found a dead, a dead diver, apparently. I mean, there's just. Who is Gabby, this person? mommy's coming. That's not uh -oh, how things. I'm stuck. Oh, oh, oh! I'm giving it all I got, Captain. Now is she? Oh. I mean, she's wearing, I guess, pearls. Sorry, Luther. And a hat. Don't mention it. Gabby, my little guppy is stuck inside that <laughs> cage. <laughs> but I can't fit fit stuck. inside. Kinda. Could you please find Leave him? her there. That was her. That was self-inflicted. Yes, Look, she, he positioned know, himself just real, where he wanted Gabby. to be when they pulled her out. All right. So I, I mean, I guess this is—is is this clothing or is that her body? Were they pulling on, like, a fin? Freddy! Luther! I'm stuck under this rock! Please help me! I'm stuck! What are we going to do? Don't worry, Gabby. We just need to find a bigger board to pry the rock off your fin. Why are all the fish getting stuck? I don't know, Ica. It's it's concerning. Lots of lot lots of stuck step fish, it seems. Yeah. Oh. What a beautiful show! And we take that. Okay, that time was just for fun, I guess. Can we? Okay, I guess not. I was like, can we get that guy to help? Did you find my guppy? Yes, Mrs. Halibut. Gabby stuck. Mrs. Halibut. It's okay. Oh, thank goodness. All right. Well, we gotta keep moving. We're just gonna leave you here. We'll be back in 123 hours. Oh, it's another one of these. We found another purple sea urchin. I do like this casual music. The beach is up there. <laughs> okay, what am I trying to... Uh... Hey, that's a reference to one of the other things they made. Putt-putt the car. Now the question becomes... Oh no. 
nice. It's a wooden boar. It is. Wait, do I actually need to help the crab, or is that a joke? Fiddler crab, what's wrong? Oh me, oh my, oh me, oh my. How did I get in this cage? I must get out of this cage. Please help me get out, and I'll give you my fishing pole. Oh, that... Hold on. Wait a second. Why do you have a fishing pole? Fiddler crab, what's wrong? Oh me, oh my, oh You me, shouldn't oh have my. a fishing pole. How did I get in this cage? That's not okay, I right? I get out of this cage. Please help me get out, and I'll give you my fishing pole. That's not okay. Oh, there's a... Okay, I thought I had to go back, but there's actually... Well, that's terrifying. Wait, what are we doing? You have oh. three buckets of jellyfish to feed the animals. I'll toss the what? jellyfish to the hungry animals, and you Just can take the pole. Who's <laughs> gonna, what's he gonna do about it? Yeah, he's... Get set. It's feeding time. Uh, okay. Oh, it's like space invaders, but there's no crosshair on this. This is actually sort of. It's difficult you and. You did great, Freddy. You fed them all. We can leave when the arrow flashes. Get ready, Freddy! Those turtles look hungry. Oh, okay, so we keep going until... Until... Uh, we leave when we want. Also, do turtles eat jellyfish? That seems incorrect. Do turtles eat jellyfish? <laughs> Crabs enjoys hunting their neighbors? Apparently, yeah. You did great, Freddy! You still have three buckets of jellyfish left. Let that was fun, Freddy! Yeah, I'm not you interested sure in continuing was, this. But we'd better continue our search for Grandma Grouper's kelp seeds. Turtles would eat souls if you let <laughs> I mean, I guess if you got the right kind of snapping turtle, yeah, they would definitely take a shot at a jellyfish. Why did she adjust her nose? I have so many odd questions. We'll be back for Mr. Crab. The, uh, the singing crab. This is the way to the old whale bones. Oh, that's what we're, we're trying to get to. Oh, I don't know about this guy. Hey, Ray, do you know how we can get through the shrimp net? You can't get through the shrimp net unless you got the super duper duka booka poppy gizmo. The what now? You can't get the super duper duka booka poppy gizmo unless you give me a clock. Where are we gonna get a clock? Look in the junkyard. Also a key? It's a key. I wonder what it will unlock. The old whale bones are over here. Okay. Look! The next bottle! That's not how anchor anchors work. Oh, they're giraffe fighting. Interesting. Oh, that's disturbing. Okay, there's some necromancy and, and druid druidic magic at work here, right? That's not normal. But yes, I know some eat jellyfish. Oh, okay. I didn't know that was a real thing. Luther, we found another clue to Grandma Grouper's kelp treasure. Okay. What, wait, what did he it say? Says, or she say? To find Grandma Grouper's treasure chest, go to the junkyard. Oh, we were already on our way there. We had to go get a clock for a stingray. Uh, gee, boss, the kelp treasure ain't here. I don't know why you hid all those bottles. I put clues in the bottles so I could find my way back to where I hid the kelp treasure. Well, if you can't find that treasure chest, you're gonna have to answer to the squid father. Please, squid boss. Not the squid father. I'll clam up, spongehead. Would it... Okay, wait. Would it be that hard to push a fish 
who's just floating there, like horizontally. All right, I'm assuming. Yeah, I assume this key is for this crab. Yes. This key should get you out of the cage, fiddler crab. Oh, he's a fiddler crab. That's why he's playing. Okay. That makes more sense. Thanks for unlocking the cage. Here, you can have my fishing pole. Let's go find Grandma Grouper's kelp seeds, Luther. Yeah, loser, let's go. I mean, Luther. Time to hunt your neighbor. I mean, we were basically just handed a gun. They basically just handed us an anti-fish gun, right? Like, that's what we just acquired is, a, is an anti-fish gun. All right, let's help, uh, help out the kid while we're here, presumably. I'm still stuck. Please help me. Look, I said 123 hours later. Luther, come help! Yay! Remember, kids. T Mommy. Teamwork makes the dream work. Gabby! My Gabby! Thank you both! You can yeah. tell they're related because they have the same colored hair. Please take this purple sea urchin for saving my Gabby. Hey, oh. Mrs. Halibut. We don't know what those are for yet. Right? Okay, so is this the castle? Oh, nope. Turn that shell down. I wish I could get some sleep, Freddy. But this shell, it glows all day. It glows all night. I wish I could trade it for a shell that doesn't glow. Oh, like this? Herman, I brought you a new shell that doesn't Why glow. Why is it glowing? He's radioactive. Freddy, Freddy, isn't he? Freddy. It's wonderful. Just a second. He does sound like Zoidberg now that I think about it, though. Here, Freddy. Maybe you can use this glowing shell. Thank you, Herman. Also, Goodbye. that shell is bigger than us. How do we put it in our pocket? How did that one go? Okay. And find the kelp treasure. Okay, so we're definitely like a... An alternate dimension in like Time Lord, right? Those how are fireworks going off underwater? Right, let's keep moving. Same place the sandwich went into the the fox the the enter the, as you please. Fish pockets the fox. I nope. I don't think I can say that out loud. We found another purple sea urchin. I'm pretty sure if I say that out loud, it actually sounds like two other different words. <laughs> okay, they got me with the fishes hitting themselves in the face with the forks. Also, the castle is a giant uh, crap. Fish pockets are perfectly innocent. Yeah, but if you put them together, it sounds not so great. Is that an eyeball? Oh, that's not okay. That's that's a little messed up, actually. Oh, that's not okay either. Oh, that's what we need. That. Greetings, Freddy and Luther. Welcome to my castle. Guess that explains why it looks like a, a, a crab. What are those? More humans confirmed. Why aren't you kids out playing with the other school fish? We're on an important mission. 
I see. All right, I guess that's okay. Well, I guess we're done here. <laughs> wow, did Freddy just knock Luther down? For whatever that means underwater? I guess we just go back. We don't know what we need to do here yet, so. All we know is we have a glowing shell and a, and a, a fish gun. And we need to make make our way to the, uh, the junkyard. Okay, that's Grandma's house. Oh, there's the junkyard. Oh, look, it's 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 uh, Tomater or whatever his name is from uh, Cars. What is happening? I'm Mr. Starfish, your math teacher for today. Welcome to class. How hard do you want the questions to be? Easy, medium, hard, very hard, or advanced? Let's try some advanced okay. math. Advanced it is. What is the sum of 30? Oh, one. Okay. 32. That's correct. That's not really try advanced one. math. It's what just bigger number math. 80. 90. You're right. Imagine if it was calculus, speedy now maths. Now let's yeah. try another. What is? Thirty-one. You're right. These are we just big it. number Great. math. This Question isn't complicated. Right. Let's do another problem. How much is? Oh, that's actually 40. not a bad one. Eight. You're right. Now let's try another. What is? Seventy-six. 83. You're right. You have answered five. Problems right. Let's do another problem. What is the difference between 74 and 53? Oh, yeah, yeah. 21. That's correct. 20. Yay, One. yay, yay! Now try this one. What is the sum of the challenge? The, the actual uh, difficulty That's of these correct. varies very wildly. Now let's try another. What is seventy-four? That's correct. Yay! 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 Here's another equation. How much is oh. forty-two? You're right. We've okay, how many of these do I actually have to do? Right. Let's do another problem. They're, like, they're what not giving me a prompt to leave. 70, 3, and 25. Like, I, I don't know. Let <laughs> the teacher finish speaking. Are you, is it bothering you that I'm, I'm cutting him off with my answers? Is that the problem? 48. You're right. Let's do another problem. What is... Just rude as all. 32 plus 28. 60. Very good. We've gotten 11 questions right. How many Let's more of these do, do I have to do? another problem. What is Be respectful, the difference the star wants between you to learn. 34 and 30? 4. Very good. Now try this one. That's How much is 97 plus I think you keep going until you press stop. Two. Oh, oh, I didn't see. I didn't even notice there was a stop button. I didn't even notice there was a stop button. I regret telling you that. Yeah, I would have been at that for a little while longer if you not said that. Hey, it's the it's the the mara or no the uh, little clocker things you wanted to use in D and D. Um, let's grab the urchin while we're here. 
We found another purple sea urchin. Hey, stop that. <laughs> it's not consenting. All right, let's keep moving. Click the car? Oh, I don't know if I can click the car from... Now we're gonna be rich, rich, rich! Luther, we don't want to wake up the junkyard dogfish. Gotta get a dogfish. Let me see if I can click on the car from here. Uh, no, it's, that's the, that's how you progress. So there's, I can't click on the car. I think we clicked on basically all the clickables. Yeah. So... Look, ready to model. Now we're gonna be rich, rich, rich. Luther, we don't want to wake up the junkyard dogfish. What happens if we do though? Wow. Did we just die? I guess we can get past him. If we had a bone, we could give it to the dogfish and he might go away. Ah, okay. That's what we're looking for. We need a bone, everybody. Oh, he got him. He actually bit Luther. We're going to have to put the dogfish down. That's disturbing. Kill the dogfish? Yeah, I don't have a bone to distract the dogfish, apparently. Luther has bones to be... That's true, but we need a non-living non bone to feed the dogfish. We don't want to feed Luther to the dog. At least not yet. Okay, what's this way, then? Is that a skull? Oh, that's not what I meant to click on, but... Okay. You don't want to feed Luther... You don't want to feed... What? Now no one gets past Eddie the Eel. <laughs> but we're looking for Grandma Grouper's kelp treasure. If we don't find it soon, all the fish are gonna die. Oh, I've heard that one before. You have? Look, kids, why don't you just get out of here before I have to eat you? Okay, okay. It's a glowing shell. It's a glowing shell. Ah, okay. Mmm, yum! Grandma Grouper's famous peanut butter and jellyfish sandwich. I guess that I was can a let you get past. Good luck finding Grandma Grouper's kelp treasure. Well, Looks like the coast is clear well, at least he now. is an idiot. <laughs> and these people I really have no care for jellyfish. No. Apparently jellyfish is the lowest form of, of fish. Oh, we can go into all three. Okay, let's start up at the top right. Ah, this is what we needed. The I'm glowing shell. Look, Luther. There's nothing scary in here. I'm not scared now. We found another purple sea urchin. I don't know how I feel about all the litter we keep seeing. Uh, let's go at the other eyeball. Oh no, Freddy! I can't see! I'm blind! It's just dark in here, that's all. We have something that would help us see. Luther, truly the, the genius yeah. amongst us all. Now we can see. This place isn't so bad with the lights on. Expected to happen. All right, nothing in this one. 
Back we go. Time to go into the, the nose. Oh no, Freddy! I can't see! I'm blind! It's just dark in here, that's all. We have something to make it bright. Oh, they actually did a different voice line for each one of these. Look, Luther, there's nothing scary in here. This place isn't so bad with the lights on. <laughs> it just takes a swing at you. What? Okay. Is that a dinosaur? Alright, so I guess the only thing we really needed from this was the... Uh, sea urchin and out of that one eye, I guess. All right. Nothing there to progress our story. And that's uh, presumably back the way we... Oh, no, that is a different direction. Where are we going? This place is scary. An uh, underwater Oscar the Crouch. Uh, okay, is that it? Is that literally all we're doing here? It's a fishing pole. Okay, apparently. Okay, we're gonna have to come back, I guess, because there's literally nothing here. Unless it's just to have stuff to click on. The volcano on. is this way. The volcano, you say? Okay. The gate needs to be open more before we can get through. Oh, okay. The gate's still not open enough for us to get through. The gate's almost open enough for I us to like get I feel like you through. could squeeze through there, Fr Freddy and Luther. Gates open. All right. There's so much stuff underwater. I don't. I don't care for. Then. That was a lot. That's like a uh, a full size uh, uh, giant the squid that came out of that. Here. Came out of that volcano. Clamshell Theater live show today. Step right up. Okay, what kind of show is this going to be, everyone? We got to know what kind of show this is. I don't know if I can, you know, this could be some kind of an intense R-rated show. I don't know if I can show this on on stream. What do we think this is going to be? I'm very curious what this is going to end up being. It's a clamshell theater being promoted by a, a squid with a hat or a, gr a green growth. What do we think this is going to be? Carriage building show? I mean, maybe. I mean, Luther's already been bit by a dog, and they're already worried about starving to death. Literally every fish is going to die if they don't find the seeds <laughs> for Grandma Grouper's uh, kelp garden or whatever. You would think more people would be involved in this, but apparently the rest of the fish don't care. Augie's Magnificent Show. Wow! 
Welcome, girls, boys, and fish of all ages to the greatest show under the sea. We've got some great acts here today, sure to make your gills quiver with delight. Uh... So, put your fins together for our first fantastic performance. <laughs> I left the room. Was there a murder? No. We're trying to figure out... We were trying to guess what kind of show we're about to watch at the Clamshell Theater. Shh. Is that it? Why are we... Oh, Frank, Frank the Fabulous Frog. Okay, yeah. Wow. Frank is pretty underwhelming, just a bit. Okay, Helga the Singing Mermaid. Ah, the classic. The classic. <laughs> and then Amazing Augie? This is the one we... Oh, it's the doorman. Did they just hang her? No, no. She grabbed onto that with one of her tentacles, I think. Luke Fish Von ba Bass. Luke? Okay. <laughs> Luke Fish Von Bastoven. Wait, why do they sound like frogs? What? Carpen, Mar Carpen Marana? Wait, Marana? What? Oh, okay. Okay, so this was that part I was worried about showing on stream, clearly. I thought something came down and pulled her up. No, 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 she, she reached up and grabbed onto her. The Flying Carp Brothers. They're underwater. That's actually synchronized swimming. That's not flying. I guess it's the flying carps, as in like flying fish. But the flying implies they're doing like a tumbling routine. Recital featuring Clovis P. Tortu? I don't know what that's a reference to. Wow, they didn't even give him a chance. Huffo the Amazing Expanding Fish. Yeah, we know what that is. <laughs> Stand up comedy bit beforehand. Okay. Also underwhelming. Bump and Gump. Those aren't clownfish. Also, how does that work? They're underwater. Wow, they were really happy to see them leave the stage. Oh, and we're back to Frank the Fabulous Frog. Okay. Okay, well, I mean, that was something, but what does it have to do with what's going on? How is that helping us with the, our current problem? All right, 
just back the way we go. I guess that was just for the funds of watching that. We just watch a what what a basically breaks down to a bunch of screensavers from like Windows 96 or something like. We go to Windows 95, upgraded a year, and we have Windows 96, the screensaver collection or something. Okay, so where do we get a bone from? Grandma Groper's house is over here. Do we need something else from her? Look, all the fish can starve a bit if it means Freddy gets entertained at the theater, right? <laughs> oh, that's... Pleased to meet you. <laughs> okay. A little bit of a oh rendering dear. error there. Oh dear. Until we find my treasure chest, we have no food. We'll find your treasure chest, Grandma Grouper. I'm so glad you're both helping me. Goodbye, Grandma Grouper. Hmm, all right, so where didn't I go yet? We know what the, sh the glowing shell's for. That's the king. Do I need this? It's a fishing pole. I guess not. Am I missing a... Oh, it's a seal. We got the shell. We gave the shell to somebody. What do I need a fishing pole for? Let's go find the next bottle, Freddy. This is the way to the old whale bones. The old whale bones are over here. What do I need this fishing pole for? It's a fishing pole. Oh. So this guy wants a clock. But we can't get the clock or the... Okay, this leads up. We already took care of this area. Maybe we can go into the... The... Let's go find the next spot. Yeah, I know. I know, Luther. Shut up. We don't need to talk to the king about anything. Maybe there's a way for me to get the clock... Independent of the dog? I mean, I don't see a bone anywhere. We should hurry to the junkyard. Look, Freddy, the bottle! Now we're gonna be rich, rich, rich! But first, we have to get past that hungry dogfish. Oh, we do need this here. Nope, not for that. There's more than one way to catch a dogfish. Wow. That dogfish looks mean and hungry. So... We do need this here. But not... There's more than one way to catch a dogfish. Is there, though, Fred? Fred, my friend? What am I... Look at all the... What? Bone on a rod, I, I presume? Yeah, I guess so, but we don't... I haven't seen any place with a bone. Put Luther on the rod? Okay, so there's got to be one other location we haven't been to. We need there to wasn't... find the next bottle soon. Because at the old well bones, we couldn't pick up any of those bones, right? Take Luther's bones? I'm pretty sure he needs his bones. I mean, he is an eyeless ghoul, but he still has, you know, he still needs to be able to prop up his still alive corpse somehow. Rod the bones. Yes, rod the bones. Let's see. I guess that's maybe that's what I need to do, and it's just not prompting me. 
We need to find that this is the way to the old whale bones. The old whale bones. I don't like this guy. The old That's whale stranger bones danger right here. there. The 1990s taught me anything, but that guy's stranger danger. Look, Luther, it's a bone. I can take. Okay, so I guess we couldn't take it before because we didn't know we needed it. So we can take that, even though before I couldn't interact with it. I mean, I guess that's logical. We didn't know we needed it, so we didn't bother taking it. No, we don't need a walkthrough just yet. Thank you, though. I swear I'm not an elk. I didn't realize this was procedurally generated. I thought we could just pick up any random item we were going to need at the moment, but no. We actually have to do this in, a, in the correct order. Huh. I guess that means you can't like speed run it by knowing where everything Look, is. Ready the bottle. Now we're gonna be rich, rich, rich. Luther, first, we've been over we this. Have to get past that hungry dogfish. We've been over this. Nice doggy. Here's a bone for you. Oh, I don't like that view down its mouth with like the fishy. Throat. No, Looks that's... like the coast is clear. Now we can pick up that bottle. All right. So now where are we headed? The clue says find the three caves and enter the one on the left. The kelp treasure must be really close now, Luther. Okay, so yeah, that's what it was. We couldn't go back. We have to do it in the correct order. Oh, that's disturbing. That's incredibly disturbing. Oh, that's not what I meant to do. Wait, what is happening? Water? Oh, clam up, spongehead! You lost the treasure, so now you got to see the squid father. Oh, please, boss. Not the squid father. The squid father. I'm gonna love him. It's just like their dad. He's just very disappointed in them. All right, I gotta go into that truck though and get a clock. Oh, there's the clock. Why are there so many fish this deep in the water? Now we can trade Ray for his super duper duka puka poly gizmo. Which probably isn't actually going to do anything. So that sounds like a piano, but the, the other thing that's supposed to be a piano sounded like frogs. This universe is very confused. Let's go to the caves. Let's go to the caves and uh, do the cave stuff first. I mean, for old cartoon art, this isn't actually that bad. All right, the one on the left, because I know my left's from my right, because you hold up your hand and the thing that makes place, an L Freddy. is the left. It's awfully dark in here. We have something. We do have something for that. Look, Luther, there's nothing scary in here. I wasn't really scared, Freddy. Look, it's a bottle. It says the treasure is hidden in the sunken ship. Let's go get the kelp seeds at the old ship. I know just where it is. Could you tell me? Because I actively don't. Oh, Next no, Sunday no, you do the no, speed no. run. I put all my clues in bottles so I could find my way back to the treasure. 
So I thought I put the first bottle with the Nexus. Let us in our Nexus. But, but, the Squid Father. Oh, was the first bottle with the king? Come on, Spongehead. Think! The Squid Father trusted us to hide the stolen kelp treasure for him. <laughs> but, 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 Squid Father. Oh, no! He's spewing ink! <laughs> I remember where the treasure is! Come on, Spongehead! Oh, it just takes us straight to the Look, ship. Look, Luther, the sunken ship! This is where Grandma Grouper's kelp treasure should be! Aye, matey! That old shipwreck has held so many treasures over so many years! We're looking for Grandma Grouper's treasure. Good luck, mates. You okay? You've got a lot going on. How he's underwater? He can't fall. So is the plan to eat the treasure? Uh, presumably, they're gonna get the seeds hey, out of Freddy, there, and then they're gonna grow it. Behind that window. Look, Luther! Grandma! Maybe Luther, Luther is actually blind? Is in there. Yes! Now I'm gonna be rich, rich, rich! Luther, Grandma Grouper's cup treasure is for everyone to share. And besides, the window is closed and it's much too heavy to open. If we can find a handle for the crank, we could crank open the window and swim inside. Let's go find a crank handle. You could use this sword to just break the window. You have jurisdiction. It is a life-saving emergency. Yeah, there's some underwater ghosts. Hmm. Just pull, you would think, right? Just pull the rope. But if you don't have the handle, is this like caviar? What is this? I'm going to the oh, it's, zoo. There's Putt-Putt. Putt-Putt goes to the zoo. That's not what those sound like. Oh my god, did we get the captain's log of how everyone died? Oh no, it's just a... What? Arr, you little ones. I'm Phineas McFinn, the finest sailor on the seven seas. Arr! Okay. Arr! There's just one word that says it all. Arr! Arr when I'm happy. Arg when I'm sad. Arg when I'm good or bad. Arg! Arg to port. Arg to starboard. Arg from stem to stern. Arg! Arg, yes, Wally. Arg! And a yo ho ho hum hum, my chum. Arg! What's that you say? Arg! I can't hear ya. Arg! They're already One being indoctrinated with the life of a bird. Very good. Excellent. In fact, Arg! The handle is broken. Hey, that's okay. Arg! If you could find old Phineas another musical instrument, I would gladly trade you this useless crank handle. <laughs> okay, that makes sense. Hey, it's Flounder from uh, Little Mermaid. There's the dead people. It's humongous? What? Huh. That crutch might come in handy. Next thing you know, they'll be wielding AK as they sail around the coast of Somalia. Basically, that's kind of what I was thinking, yeah. They're going to be getting into the drug... At their age, they're already doctrinated with the pirate life. And they're just going to be getting into, like, swashbuckling. And it's just going to progress until they wake up one day laying on, like, a, a beach somewhere. Which is bad for them because they're fish. I think there was more effort put into the wacky background stuff than the actual, like, rest of the module. But we did get a crutch. 
I don't do arg, like arg, pew pew pew. I mean, we have a fish gun, right? We have a gun for fish. <laughs> pew pew pew, it's the modern arg? I don't... Ika, I think you went to the wrong school of, of pirating. Look, Luther! Grandma Grouper's cup treasure Oh, I thought they there. would do something else. Sorry. Yes! Now I'm gonna be rich, rich, rich! Luther, Grandma Grouper's cup treasure is for everyone to share. And besides, the window is closed and it's much too heavy to open. If we can find a handle for the crank, okay, we so can we need... crank open the window and swim inside. Let's go find a crank handle. Okay, well, we know where the crank handle is. We just gotta go find an instrument. It's my modern arg. You are my least favorite kind of pirate. Okay, do we just swim away? Wait, how do I go back? I still gotta turn in the the clock. That yeah. old ship sailed through hurricanes, typhoons, thunder, and lightning. But it went down in the great gulf of Ort 7. The great what? When that ship went down, there were many treasures. I saw all of them before they were taken by the squid father. Ah. Okay, so going up takes us to the ship. How do I go... Back? I guess I can't leave. I guess everything... Wait, I guess everything we're doing... I guess we have to finish up whatever's going on with the boat before we can leave? We're locked in. We're locked in, team. So we gotta find an instrument. I mean, there's a bell right there. It's a crutch. It's a fishing pole. I mean, a crutch is not an instrument. Oh, I'm an idiot. I just realized what we- And starring Sam Miller. That's not, okay. Well, starring Sam Miller, whoever that is. The fish outside of the boat is standing on a on a on some kind of instrument instead of a crutch because he's got one leg. I assume he was standing here we speak, should for get comfort. The treasure soon. But he actually needs a crutch. Would you like this crutch? Aye! Me old crutch. Thanks, matey. Now I don't need this old mandolin. Would you like it? Yes, please. Thanks. There we go. I would say that's legitimately a good deed we just did. Instead of trying to swim around on a mandolin, he's instead swimming around on a crutch, which is appropriate. How about Finish. that, bud? Here's another musical instrument for you. Great. Here, take this crank handle. Thanks, Phineas. Arg! There's just one word that says it all. Arg! Arg when I'm happy. Arg when I'm sad. Arg when I'm good That's or bad. That's a piano. Arg! Arg to port. Arg to starboard. Arg from stem to stern. Arg! Arg, yes, wabby. And a yo ho ho hum hum, my chum. Arg! What's that you say? Arg! I can't hear ya. Arg! We don't need one more time. Arg! Very good. Excellent. In fact, Arg! All right. Well, that worked out. But yeah, he was playing that mandolin, and it sounded like a piano. Arg! <laughs> also not what that sounds like, but alright. Ok, 
convenient that that worked Let's out that go way. Get Grandma Grouper's guilt seed. Hot dog, I'm gonna be rich. We've talked about this, Luther. You're not going to be rich. That's not what's in there. We found Grandma Pew. Grouper's treasure chest. There's very shockingly little to click on in here. Weird. Grandma Grouper's Kelp Treasure! Yeah! Uh-oh, the sharks are here. Uh-oh. They just, like, Told you beat up Luther in front of Freddy. Boys. Okay, you two. Hand over the treasure. Bite off one of his no. fins. Grandma Grouper's kelp seeds are for everyone to share. But we gotta take the treasure to the squid father, so we can grow some kelp. If we share the seeds, we can all grow kelp. Share the kelp seeds? Gee, boys. The kelp seeds Shoot are them. for we, I mean, everyone. we do have a fish gun. You're not Wait. wrong. I got an idea. We can share the kelp seeds. <laughs> Great wow, idea, Wow, your boss is going to be very upset with you. Yeah. Yay! <laughs> Let's go tell the squid father we're all going to share. Oh, my God. He just, they, he's like, yeah, boss, we're just going to share. And he just grabs like a, a, a bat and just Aye. Like, beating them both. Aye. Kelp, you found the kelp. The marvelous kelp. Okay, so this is magic. Wait, is that the end? Yay! You found the treasure! Wait, what about the king? And what about the the sun the the stingray guy? Freddy, you found the treasure! Saved your treasure, Grandma Grouper. Well, okay, Freddy helped a little, but I figured it out. I was very brave. Oh, I'm sure you were, Luther. Now, can you both help me plant the seeds? That... Okay. There were these big mean sharks. There must have been 50 sharks. I was dodging left and right, swimming loop-de-loops. I'm so proud of you both. Why don't we go inside so you can tell me all about your adventure? Well, you, you look like the front. Wait, how is that the end? <laughs> Here we go again! Wait, wait, how is that the end? We didn't do like half of the stuff. What? Is there like Thanks a secret the flowers, ending? <laughs> sure thing, Freddy. Did we get the Sam's basic wonderful. ending? What? Gotta go, Sam. <laughs> Bye, Freddy. Whoa! There's a secret ending to Freddy Fish and the and the lost kelp seeds. Um. All right. I guess we're gonna speed run it now and see what the other stuff we missed was. Hi, Snappy Turtle. Hi, Freddy. I think you may be overthinking it. You look like you need model. some cheering up. For me? But oh, thanks, we had Freddy. items that we didn't use. Have a nice day. Why Bye. Why were they giving us this extra stuff it wasn't actually re required? We missed something. That I know for a fact. I know for a fact we missed something. Hi, Grandma Grouper. Here's a flower for you. Thank you, Freddy. This What's is not a module wrong, aimed Grandma at completionist. Grouper? I so know, I but we're missing the lore. Chest. Grandma, to distract the kids, I guess that's all that it holds is. All the kelp seeds. Yes, Freddy. Look at the garden. It's died. Okay. Oh, we can actually skip that one. Okay, fantastic. Let's go grab Luther. 
Okay, good. We, we can't actually the skip that. Oh, that's actually fantastic. That makes this much better. Can I skip? I can. Okay, for, great. Okay. Gabby. Uh oh, I'm stuck. <laughs> Okay, we can just right, we leave her the there. We can just 100% leave her there. <laughs> Help me, I'm stuck. All bitch. right, we found a bottle. All right, we need this. It's a wooden board. Yep, it sure is. It sure is, Freddy. I agree, it we is a wooden board. We found another purple sea urchin. This is the way to the old whale bones. What a pretty pearl. Let's go get it. But Freddy, how are we going to get through the net to get the pearl? Hi, Ray. Shh, 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 shh. You can't get through the shrimp net unless you got the super duper duka booka poppy gizmo. I know about the super sun, super duper gizmo. It's a key. I wonder what it will unlock. The old whale bones are over here. They are. Let's move, team. Look, Luther. It's a bone. Okay, we at a minimum we needed this. Stingrays are predators, right? A pro maybe? I don't know. I cannot say I know enough about, about stingrays. Oh, I didn't pick up the notes. All no. right, we found a bottle. The note says, go to the junkyard. We found another clue to the beach is up there. <laughs> I don't need to worry about the two shark <laughs> idiots. We know that doesn't go anywhere. Fiddler this. Crab, what's wrong? I would gladly give you my fishing pole if you could please get me out of this cage. It's odd. Some stuff we can skip and some stuff we this can't. This key should get you out of the cage, Fiddler Crab. I Let's can't. Go oh, there we go. Grandma Grouper's... Okay, that takes care of that. She's still just, she's still just stuck in there, everybody. She's just still stuck in there. I'm sure she's fine. Okay. To the castle. Okay, I don't have the shell Herman, for your you. shell is too bright. Enter as you please. We found another purple. I think we needed what five of these. See, like there's this area, and there's literally nothing here. Wow, that is very nice. Greetings, Freddy and Luther. Welcome to my castle. Okay, so there's literally nothing else. I mean, we gotta bring one of the pearl, the pearl back. I just, I'm com confused on why. Can 
I'm trying to remember where else we got sea urchins from. Okay. We, need we one found more. another purple sea urchin. Look, ready the bottle. Now we we're gonna be one. rich, rich, rich. Oh no no wait if we get this one Oh no no this one will send us to the 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 three uh holes in the skull. Nice doggy. Here's a bowl. Looks like the coast is clear. Now we can pick Okay, we got to go find out what stingray what we do with this other pearl. Hey, a claw. Now we can trade Ray for his super duper duka buka poly gizmo. For no reason, though, apparently. Look, Freddy, the bottle. Now we're gonna be rich, rich, rich. The clue says the kelp treasure must be really close. <laughs> Not the. So let's go give the clock and actually find out what what Ray is going to do with this and what we need the pearl for. We need the deepest Freddy fish lore you've ever seen, which is to say any of it ever. Keep on moving, team. She's fine. She's perfectly fine. Doesn't need any help from us. This never has, never will. Old whale bone. All right. All right, Ray, we're back. Thanks for the clock. You're welcome, Ray. Now you get the super duper duka buka poly gizmo. Thank you for the super duper duka buka poly gizmo. Nice of course, doing why business. Why would she ever you? need help? No, she's fine. I don't see how this thing is going to get us through the net. Oh, that's how. Okay. Follow the pearl. Oh, they're teaching us the shell game so we can make money on the streets. Where do you, you think, think the, the pearl is? is? You're right. Wonderful. Take this pearl as your prize. Oh. Only one pearl per customer. Thanks! Uh, okay, we have the pearl. How do I leave? Right, go back up. Oh, we get to keep it. Interesting. Yeah, she wants to be there. Yeah, she's there on purpose. She got her head stuck in there. You know, she just really wants to hang out. She wants to be able to talk to her kid, but not actually have to interact with her kid, you know? As someone who's not a parent, I assume that's how it works. You want to be able to see your kids, but you don't have to want to, you don't want to actually interact with them. What a pretty pearl. Why are we keeping the dream? Yeah, exactly. Enter as you please. The super duper duka buka poly gizmo can open the shrimp net. What a pretty pearl. Wait. There's another bottle. What? King Crab, may I please have that bottle? I would gladly give you this beautiful bottle if you would give me a beautiful pearl. Okay, we have one of those for you. Ooh, I got stuck under the bed earlier and was too ashamed to call my partner for help. Pearl, Freddy and Luther. Now you may have my beautiful bottle. Thank you, King Crab. This bottle will help us find the A few minutes to struggle, treasure. but I survived. I mean, you could have given him the party partner, come and help me. I'm stuck. The 
treasure is hidden in the sunken ship. Oh. Luther, let's go get the kelp seeds at the old ship. I know just where that is. I do hope you'll find Grandma Grouper's treasure. Oh, oh so this is just an alternate entrance into the final area. Look, Luther, the sunken ship. This is where Grandma Grouper's kelp treasure should be. So I, I guess the... That old shipwreck has held so many treasures over so many years. We're looking for Grandma Grouper's treasure. Help me, step treasure. partner. I'm stuck. Yeah, exactly. Good luck, mates. So I guess the fishing rod isn't for anything, then? Huh. It's a fishing pole. It's Grandma's last peanut butter and jellyfish sandwich. Wait, I can. Cord wouldn't make a good crutch. Wait, why can I use the that? The clue says the treasure is hidden in the sunken ship. The super duper duka booka polygizmo can open the shrimp net. Huh? Yeah, I guess we just get to keep some of this stuff. But the fishing. Hey, Freddy! What do you think is behind that window? Specific question. Look, Luther. The super duper duka booka poly. I don't want to break the window. Wh why not? It's a fishing pole. It's Grandma's last peanut butter and jellyfish sandwich. Why don't we want to break the, the the window? That would in fact solve our problem. Arr, you little ones. I'm Phineas McFinn, the finest sailor on the seven seas. Arrgh! It's a wooden board. It's Grandma's last peanut butter and... It's a fishing pole. The super duper duka booka polygizmo can open the shrimp net. Okay, so we can't... Arr, yeah. What are we... Huh. I guess there's this just might come in handy. extra random things we don't... Oh, okay. So it goes over that. That's why I could use it there. It's because you just use whatever's in that area. Interesting. Pew, pew, pew. <laughs> Ika is the, you know, Ika's a very modern day Somali pirate. He didn't say R. He just fires his AK wildly into the air. Would you like this crutch? Aye! Me old crutch! <laughs> Thanks, matey! Now I don't need this old mandolin. Would you like it? Yes, please! Thanks! So you can't even claim that this is linear. It actually has branching paths depending on how you do things. It has multiple correct answers to get to the ending. That's actually kind of bonkers. Yeah, and then I hold ship slash people hostage. Well, that part's pri that's very piratey. It's the, the the AK part and saying blam 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 instead of R is the, the problem. They bump into each other a lot. <laughs> Here's another musical instrument for you. Great. He just takes it <laughs> Take off. this here crank handle. It was broken anyways. Oh, they actually have hey, an alternate Phineas? dialogue. Arg. There's just one word that says it all. Arg. Arg when I'm happy. Arg when I'm sad. Arg when I'm good or bad. Arg. Arg to port. Arg to starboard. Arg from stem to stern. Arg. Arg yes, wally. Arg! And a yo ho ho hum hum my chum. Arg! What's that you say? Arg! I can't hear ya. So the Arg! fishing pole really One has no more use. Time. Arg! Very good. Excellent. In fact, Arg! So we're just carrying around this fish gun for no reason. That's really weird. Alright, 
Well, we found a, an alternate route to get to the ending of this. And found alternate dialogue if you do, like, change Let's the order of things. Let's go get Grandma Grouper's kelp seed. Hot dog, I'm gonna be rich. We found Grandma Grouper's treasure chest. The super duper grand is a fishing pole. The clue says the treasure is I have four purple fairies. We can leave for some reason, but why would you leave? This is the ending. There's nothing else you can do. That's really strange. Grandma Grouper's kelp treasure. Hi. Kelp, you found the kelp, a marvelous kelp. Huh. Wow. So in theory, this actually is more involved. So this is actually more technically involved story-wise and like pathways than a lot of like modern stuff that you actually have alternate ways to get to the ending that all work and have altered dialogue if you change up the order of operation on things. That's actually more complex than a lot of modern stuff in the dumbest ways possible. Wow. Wow. Oh, you can actually in increase the subtitle speed. Bye! Alright. Are you sure you want to quit? Yes. Well, we did it, everyone. We, we explored the depths of Freddy Fish and uh, the missing kelp seeds. What? Okay, what are the alternate... Oh, those are trading cards, not achievements. I was about to say, how did I not get all the achievements? But there's no achievement. It's all just trading cards. Proud of you. Thank you, everyone. We've done it. We we as a group, it took it took three grown adults to make it all the way through Freddy Fish and the, the missing kelp seeds. All right. So even with the alternate path, that only took us an hour and a half. It has trading cards. Yes, it has six. It has six trading cards. We got the one of the starfish teacher. We got two of them, actually. We got duplicates for some reason from the, the starfish. <laughs> Let me just show that off for a second. Oh, God. Okay. That's the kind of stuff you need in your life, you know? Top-notch top, top -notch fan art? Yeah. Oh, no, see, this. This looks like something I would make in, in paint right here. Mr. Godzilla's uh, Freddy Fish. <laughs> very flat, very <laughs> oblong Freddy Fish. That took exactly a thousand hours in paint to get that done. Okay, I, I guess I really want to know. I got to look this up now. I got to look this up. Freddy Fish. Freddy Fish. Fish. Uh, fishing pole. Rod. What is it for? Hold on. Let me see something. Freddy Fish, the fishing pole belongs to Fiddler Crab. In all storylines, Freddy Fish. Freddy Fish and Luther can obtain the fishing pole after rescuing Fiddler Crab from the cage via key. The fishing pole can be obtained in all storylines. It is only necessary in the Grand Canyon storyline. In the Grand Canyon storyline, Freddy and Luther must use the fishing pole to retrieve the message bottle after it falls into the home of the angler fish, as it's the only thing that can allow them to get it without disturbing slash, slash getting too close to the angler fish. Oh, so there isn't even a third. There's a third path. All right, new project. We have to. We have a week to submit our Freddy Fish fan art on Discord. Yes, I would love to see that. We just fill up the the fan the art section with Freddy Fish uh, fan art. Yes, let's do it. Totally down. I'll put. A, I'll talk to Ron, uh, uh, to Ron and get. Uh, uh, get uh, uh, get that out on the onto the uh, the Twitterverse. So apparently there's even a third 
a third way to get to the ending where we use the the uh, fishing pole to get by the angler fish to retrieve one from the Grand Canyon, as it were. I assume that's that area we, we didn't have a, anything to do. Very interesting. Very interesting. 